So I'm here at Groth Vineyards with Suzanne Groth. Say hi. Hi. And you've kicked me over to your director of wine growing, Cameron Perry, and we're in the reserve block, or yep. one of your two reserve blocks. Absolutely. And you've had a really rainy spring and uh, winter, and so you got a really high cover crop. Let's talk about the cover crop for a quick, quick second first. What are you doing here? Sure. Cover crop's all about farming for carbon. You gotta get carbon into your soils to feed your soil microorganisms. That's what they live on. So we, we grow up a big healthy cover crop during the winter till it in in alternate rows. We do a partial no-till situation here at Groth. Feed that soil, get it nice and healthy. From healthy soil comes healthy vines. Healthy vines set reliable, tasty crop. And then soil, you got a couple things in your hand. Oh, I yeah. like to play with rocks too, so. Sure, what do we so got? you know, at the base of everything is the geology. What we have here is radiolinear chert and some stones from the Franciscan formation. Chert's the red one. The only place you find chert here in the Napa Valley region is all the way over in Childs Valley. So you go out to Lake Berryessa and it litters the shores out there. But nowhere else here in the floor of the Napa Valley do you find these stones, which is a big kind of question mark. It's like, all right, what's it doing here? Well, this little piece of our world, our reserve blocks, just this small little bit of acres, these 26 acres that we have here, are sitting on top of a remnant of an ancient alluvial fan that came out of where Lake Hennessy is now. There's a reason they put a reservoir there. It drains a huge watershed. So millions of years ago, that alluvial fan came out of that Lake Hennessy watershed. This is before the Mayakamas were uplifted, so a very, very long time ago. In the ensuing years, that fan has been eroded away, covered up, otherwise destroyed. And really all that's left is this like 500 yard wide swath of this ancient, ancient alluvial fan that runs right here under our reserve block and kind of up under our neighbor's property, and that's about it. And that's really the, the extent of it. So it's a unique little piece of geology, grows some amazing cabinet. And the reserve block has always been a vineyard selection rather than a winery selection because of that soil. Absolutely, you got it.